Hey there everyone, I'm Jack from Nexus Mods and welcome back to our Vortex tutorial series. This time, I'll be telling you all about profiles, what they are and how to use them. So let's take a look. Profiles are a feature within Vortex that lets you set up different mod lists for the same game. This is particularly useful if you like to vary the mods you use between different character builds or playstyles. For example, if you love spending as much time as we do in the Cyberpunk character creator, you might want to experiment with different complexion or cyberware mods that typically would conflict with each other. Setting up a profile makes it easy to swap between these sets. To get started with profiles, head to Settings, then Interface, and then finally, Enable Profile Management. And you're all good to go. After that, you'll notice a new tab on your sidebar appropriately named Profiles. These are unique to each game, but you can have as many as you want and they can each be individually named to make it easier to know at a glance what each mod list does. You can even clone these profiles or set up a desktop shortcut to make it even easier to get into the game. Super convenient. Once you've enabled the profile you want to use, just hit the play button as usual and you'll head straight into the game. Want to change the mod list you're using? Just quit the game, choose the new profile and start it up again. Some games, those by Bethesda, even let you attach a profile to a specific save file. The toggle for this feature can be found here on the edit switch on the profile selection screen. So that's Profiles, a really useful feature within Vortex that should make your modding life just that little bit easier. In upcoming videos, I'll be talking to you about load order and how to download a collection from nexusmods.com. For now though, why don't you check out some of our other videos or head over to nexusmods.com to download some mods for yourself. I'll see you around. Bye.